Hello, welcome to part two of our tutorial on how to put Ubuntu Mate on the laptop. In the, the first video, I told you how to get the OS, which is actually called a distro in Linux terminology, but that's for another day. But how to get Linux or Ubuntu Mate on a stick like this. And if so watch that video if you haven't yet. This one I'm going to show you how to get the operating system onto your laptop. First you want to plug the stick in to a USB port on your laptop, whatever old laptop you're getting. Like so. Alright. Most, not most, all laptops have a boot from stick feature you want to look in your boot options. Windows 10 I know is on here and some of you are like why are you taking off Windows 10? because Ubuntu Mate is going to go a lot faster. Notice in the screen boot options which was F12 so that's the button I pressed and that's only that's for this um, laptop. I'm booting from a storage device now I said it's only for this laptop press F12 other computers have different buttons. Um, you'll have to figure that out. Just Google it. Find out what your computer is called and say Google uh, boot option key. Now my phone's going there. Anyways, I'm going from a USB storage device because that's what's plugged in. Then it should give me options as to how I want to boot in to Ubuntu Mate. And I'll tell you why here in a second. Takes a while. That's the Ubuntu Mate uh, loading screen. Now it says it's checking. It's going to check and make sure that everything I put on this stick is okay for my computer to have. I'm going to Control C because I have now used this stick to at least put Ubuntu Mate on two other computers so I know it's okay but I would encourage you if this is your first time putting Ubuntu Mate on your laptop to let it do that scan it's about five to ten minutes what it's going to load me to is a demo mode so basically I'm going to be ret I'm going to be running this OS entirely off my stick and this demo mode is good to check out and make sure that all the hardware on my computer is going to be compatible with Ubuntu Mate. So now I already know the volume works. I don't know if you heard that chime in function or sound. So the volume feature works. I'm going to tell it that I want to try Ubuntu Mate and not install right away. Like I said, to do this demo mode. In order to make sure everything works, one of the things I want to make sure that works is the internet. Because even though my old laptop has an old wireless card, it's already telling me that there are networks available, so I know that the internet works. But I'm just saying one of your laptops may not have uh, a well working wireless card but mine apparently does so we'll I'm gonna check the password and you get to check my house out and connect One of the things I like about Ubuntu Mate is that it gives you a different desktop um, setups. Um, both of my nieces so far seem to like the Apple setup. So I'll just do that even though I'm testing it. And so as you can see, it's kind of like Apple, it has the dock down here. And this is kind of frightening. It's taking forever for my Wi-Fi to connect. 
Well, while that is still trying to connect, what are a, what are a few of the things that I do whenever I test out a iOS or an OS? Well, the wireless, which doesn't seem to be working. So that's kind of, like I said, a little bit frightening. Oh. Looks like I need to push this in again, so excuse me. Let me, uh... It is the right password, so hopefully it works this time. But a few other things, there we go, established. That's a lot nicer. So a few other things that we check out is since I'm online, I'm going to check out and make sure I really can browse the web because most people, believe it or not, on their laptops, it seems like that's what they do if they're a general user. And a good thing to check out is YouTube because there you can check the sound as well as how fast you can stream videos. So I'm typing in YouTube, it's going there. And the reason that this might be slow is actually my Wi-Fi, because I live out in the boonies. But it seems to be showing up, which is good. And let's just, for kicks and giggles, see what this brings up. There we go. Let's see what... Uh, I really like this guy, Learn Linux TV. So, all right, the sound's working. That's good. All right. I'm usually pretty happy after I see the sound and video works and the Wi-Fi connects. So I'm going to hit this button. And then we will begin our installation. And what this is going to do is move all the stuff on here, or not move, but copy all of the stuff on here to here. 